There you go. Awesome. Welcome everybody to my uh, annual catalog launch party. Um, completely forgot it was tonight, to be honest with you. And um, so last night I was scrambling to get everything ready. So I realized it was tonight, not tomorrow. Anyway, I'm ready. Here we go. <laughs> of course, there's a crucial uh, Oilers game on. Tonight. There is a crucial Oilers game on tonight. So oh. you're going to see how we can squeeze this all in. <laughs> <laughs> all right <laughs> all right so new annual catalog everybody has one it's exciting yeah. um for those that i gave catalogs to we got one of these uh just a little in color bookmark to show everybody what the in colors look like and so this isn't the actual catalog i'm going to look through i'm going to grab the one that's all marked up with little sticky notes and has stuff shoved inside of it <laughs> so it looks like this <laughs> Isn't it nice to have a working copy and then like a nice copy? Yeah, yeah. it is great. So, so yes, this is my stuffed to the brim annual catalog. Um, I there was uh, when I was going through it last night. I was trying to put in sticky notes, and I I did not put them in in like a really good logical way. So I may struggle going back and forth between pages <laughs> because of the way no that I worries. put stickies in. But anyway, here we go. Okay. So you can follow. <laughs> so the annual catalog is amazing. I do love it. Um, the thing that you know everybody loves about Stampin' Up is the color coordination, and uh, clearly all of the beautiful colors are shown on this page, which I absolutely love. I love it when they have a page that is dedicated to showing how amazing their color <laughs> spread is. Right. So love that. Just wanted to point that out. So I'm just going to walk through some of the things that kind of stuck out in my mind when I went through the catalog and just maybe point out a few things. I don't know. There's always like, you know, something that somebody else catches that somebody has missed. And so it's always good to go through it with um, multiple people because various people will point out various things, right? So um, always a fun way to go through the catalog in my mind. Um, I know Karen and Carolyn and I always have our little tradition of going through the catalog together. And uh, we've only been able to do it on Zoom for the last few years, but it still does the trick. So and we fun. still go, oh, I didn't even <laughs> notice that. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Um, so another we cost each to... other a lot of money. <laughs> That's true. That's very true. <laughs> so one of the pages I wanted to just uh, point you to, uh, especially for Debbie, is the kids collection. Um, the kids collection, they really expanded it. It's not just paper pumpkin anymore. Now they've got all these other kits that are available and they're only available online. They're not shown in the catalog. There's just a smattering of them in the catalog, but they always update them and are constantly refreshing and adding new stuff. So that's always a fun one to check out uh, if you're interested in having a quick, easy project that you can just kind of sit down and get through. And um, yeah, some really cute ones like the, there's this birthday one and the robots one is especially adorable. Um, just wanted to point that out. So moving along to the first uh, suite in the catalog, T Boutique. And so I've placed, how many pre-orders did I say I placed? Two, I think. <laughs> I was thinking about a third one, but I think I only placed two. Um, and the first one had barely anything in it. And then I realized I needed more. So <laughs> my second pre-order had this in it. <laughs> and so I've got the, um, the bundle here, which is super fun. So it's got a couple different teacups and some little flowers that you can put in the teacup. So these little flowers fit perfectly on uh, the leaves and they all have uh, coordinating dies that go with them. So you can cut them out. Um, so there's a couple different teacups um, with the leaves and then the full on teacup. And then there's a bunch of leaves, the flowers, little uh, citrus, and then the two little um, like tea bag tags that you can use on your cards, which are super cute. Um, so this is a really fun bundle that I've, I've been playing with a little bit. The other thing that comes in the suite is the six by six designer paper, which is super fun. Uh, it's got all of the new in colors, um, plus some crushed curry mixed in to add a bit of yellow flair to it, which is really awesome. Um, so it's got like teacups and teapots, little lemon one. This one cuts out beautifully with the uh, teacup die to make a little lemon uh, teacup, which is for fun. And then there's 
Add some greenery. Well, the paper yeah. looks really, really pretty. Pretty, yeah. yeah it is very pretty. Um, it's very, uh, it reminds me of like antique shopping and looking yeah, at all the yeah. cups in an antique store, yeah. um, which I love to do. So yeah, lots of fun patterns. The little teapots are super cute. This one is cute. Apparently this That's is really on trend is the little envelopes with the flowers blossoming out because this, you see this in the catalog several times. And we're just going to admit Marilyn who just joined. Um, this one I really love. Um, I have a card sample that uses this one. And basically what I did is if you, hi Marilyn. Hi. Um, <laughs> we just got started here. Um, so this one, you can, because the page is six by six, if you cut it in half at three inches and then in half again at three inches, then you've got a square of four teapots. But then you can do the oh. same again and you can cut it in half at half at one and a half inches. And then you have just a little square of a teapot. So I have a card that I'll show you in a minute here that does that. And it's really cool. Oh, so it cut. Oh, that's <laughs> nice to know that yes. it cuts like that. Like, so then, seriously. Yeah, it does. I know. I looked at it and I thought, hmm, I wonder. And it sure does. Wow. <laughs> so this side you of the paper. Don't know if you don't try. <laughs> exactly. It's just all the little, um, little kind of uh, subtle patterns. They're um, nice. For the back sides. That, yeah, they, yeah. they're just beautiful colors and patterns. They really are. So, That's yeah. really cute, cute paper. That's the paper. And then the last thing that comes in this suite is the uh, note cards and envelopes. I opened this last night so I could. Those are out. adorable. And adorable. so they're pre printed cards, and they are actually a full size card. And they have five different patterns, and there's four of each. So there's 20 cards in the pack, and they're each of the five in colors, which are super fun. And so pre printed, really easy to use. You just fold them in half and decorate. So nice. those are fun. And then they have the coordinating envelopes in all the different colors as well. So. So really so that comes with the suite, hey? Yeah, this whole suite oh, comes nice. with that stuff. So lots of fun. Uh, so a few of the cards that I've made playing with the suite. This one, oh, uh, was, I put this in my newsletter this today that came out this afternoon. So this was a case the catalog challenge from uh, staycation this past weekend. And uh, so this is based on a card that was somewhere in this catalog. I'll find it later on. Uh, <laughs> but it uses the dies, so it cuts out the teacup as well as the greenery and the flowers and this little leaf in the background here and of course the little tea tag which is super cute and mm. I also use the uh, uh what's it stylish shapes the new shape dies mm. that are in this catalog for that and then here's that other card I was talking oh, about oh nice so, <laughs> oh cute super cute how you can cut up that piece of paper and just make this little it's a little uh, four by four card yeah. that and Karen's disappeared and I wanted her to see this one. <laughs> can, can you spotlight your phone Carmen so it's bigger for me oh, it is spotlighted okay so why isn't it on mine <laughs> I'm not sure okay. I move and add if, it I, if I do no if I do speaker it shows up sorry oh, okay. thank you that's okay oh but now it goes back to you when you talk okay this is weird. Really... we go. oh that's weird it is that spotlighted is... It is really, really weird, but that's okay. bizarre. it's just my old eyes don't work very well. So <laughs> oh, yes, well, that, that's bizarre. Um, so this one, I cut out a bunch of different teacups. This one is stamped. This one's got the die cut over top of it. And then these ones are just cut out of the paper, uh, which are super fun. The little tag. And then Karen, you missed it. This was the little card. Oh, sorry. I had to, my order came and I didn't want oh. to sit. From the, <laughs> you got to go grab that for sure. That's <laughs> yeah. cool. That's so I pretty. Love, I love that one. Isn't that super cool? cute, right? Yeah. Super I thought it was cute. Fun. So, so, yeah. So that's a few of the cards I made with that one. So moving on and... This one, I wanted to point out on this page, if I can make the page visible here, uh, these pretty pop-up dies. These look really cool. I haven't seen them yet, but um, they basically, uh, they don't quite die cut. They just leave like an impression and they cut through, but you can pop up little bits of them. So like on the dragonfly here, you've got the wings popped up and the butterfly wings and stuff. So thought it was kind of interesting. It's a new thing. So 
we'll see what they're like. <laughs> yeah, it's different, yeah. Yeah, it is different. And then on this page here, um, this is the stamp set that I got from on tour, uh, which for Debbie, it's the um, every, uh, I guess, couple times a year we have Stampin' Up! events. On tour is the one that we had just before the catalog launched. And it was, uh, it's like a, a three hour event where demonstrators can go and learn about the new catalog, new products and stuff like that. And we all got oh. a stamp set for attending. Oh, nice. And so this was the stamp set that I got. So I just took some oh. of the DSPs. Oh, that looks um, nice. That's pretty. That's pretty. Yeah, it's so yeah. simple, right? Like, so simple, but so pretty. Yeah. And yeah. what paper is that, Carmen? Uh, it's the Waves paper. Okay. Yeah. So the oh, waves. really pretty. Wow. That's yeah. beautiful. So I just thought it was something um, really quick and simple you could do. I mean, the sentiments are nice and big. Um, mm -hmm. and really are the focal point of the card. So I thought it was a good one to share. Um, and then one thing, <laughs> another thing I love about our new catalogs that have been coming out lately is all of the punch coordination. Punches are awesome and so easy to use and they're amazing. So <laughs> there's a, a new cherry punch in this catalog. Um, sadly, our strawberry punch is retired. <laughs> but, but you can't make a fruit salad. <laughs> well, unless you've still got it, you know, we've got the lemon punch from a while ago. We've got the strawberry yeah. punch. Now we've got a cherry punch. And just keep adding one day you'll have a full fruit salad. <laughs> yeah. Maybe, yeah, maybe they'll have a, a reunion and they'll all be in one set. Maybe. That would be great. <laughs> um, so this is another suite. Uh, that's in the catalog. Again, I just thought it was interesting. Um, it come, It's a punch again. It's a label punch, which is fun. And it also has a, an embossing folder in it. And it's, you can't really see it very well here. I don't know if I can. It's quatrefoil. So it's kind of got this like antique vibe about it, which of course I love. <laughs> yes. <laughs> My favorite. So I <laughs> just wanted to point something out too. Our I like the paper suite. in that suite. I do too. I think the paper is really fun. Um, it's I wasn't nice nuts and... about the stamp set though. Yeah, I'm not so sure about the stamp set. I do like the little tile stamp. Yes. That's yeah. fun. And, and the label. I'm, I'm yeah, the sentiments are good too. I mean, there's lots of different sentiments. Yeah, right? there's great sentiments. And speaking of sentiments, the next page has a really awesome sentiment set. Yes. I am so excited to get this one. I think that's in my one. box that I just bought. Ooh, exciting. Ooh. <laughs> so nice. it's got um, four different fonts, I think. One, two, three, four, five, I don't know, four. Down the middle, Ooh. these ones, and then the really fancy ones. So, and all the same sentiments. So you've got four different happy birth. There are three different happy birthdays, um, different thinking of you. So it just lends itself to so many different ways you could use it mm -hmm. because it's got so many different styles. Mm -hmm. So. So, I have to say what a million sales achiever that designed this one. So that's always fun to point out to you. When I first saw this in the catalog, I thought, I don't get it. Like I just don't <laughs> I get know, it. I know it took us a minute, right? <laughs> and then I realized, oh, I get it and I love it. Yeah, <laughs> it's really cool. <laughs> it's I, I think it's beautiful. It is yeah. beautiful. It is. All right. So moving on. Um, one thing I wanted to point out, this catalog is different than previous ones and that we've got host rewards scattered throughout the catalog, but then they're also shown at the back. So they do have these kind of little host reward spotlights on a few pages that point out some of the host rewards. So it's something to catch your eye as you're flipping through the catalog. And then we've got another punch bundle, which is the Sweet Songbirds, which I now have to get because of Joanne. I know, <laughs> it's so stinking cute. It was not on my list either. <laughs> it's either. really cute. It <laughs> is. So it's a punch one. So another one to point out. <laughs> oh, and then um, for those of you that um, in the mini catalog, we've got the uh, beautiful shapes dies that have a stamp set that go with them. It's a bundle in that catalog. Well, there's another new stamp set here that goes with that shape size, beautiful shape size. Um, so that's something fun to look forward to, if, especially if you have the dies already, something to add to your collection. And then in the page, let's see where my next sticky is. <laughs> like I said, I uh, kind of randomly placed the stickies. Um, <laughs> 
So here is a couple of stamp sets that I just thought were really fun and have this kind of cool retro vibe about them. Um, but the thing that really stood out to me on this page was the color combination up here. Um, if I can make the light stop shining on it. Uh, so you've got a combination of Coastal Cabana and uh, Mango Melody, Granny Apple Green, and the new Sweet Sorbet, which I thought it was a really, really fun color combination. So yeah, it's unusual, is another, isn't it? Yeah, yeah this it is really another, is. It's cute. Color challenge card uh, that I made for Stampin' Staycation. And so I just took yes, that one was colors. So cute. <laughs> oh, that's cute. And used it with the ladybug bundle. So and those, ba those um, bathing suits are really, they're, it's cute. It's really it's cute. It's a really cute set. Yeah, it is. So it may end up in my collection at some point. So <laughs> I really like it. <laughs> um, another thing I just wanted to point out we've got some returning stamp sets from the holiday catalog. So we've got the Peaceful Beer. Uh, which got lots of use at Christmas time. And then if you turn the next page, uh, the Christmas season and Christmas to remember uh, stamp set and dies are back. Um, so it's always nice to see some returning stuff. Especially um, when we've bought them. Yes. You know, that, that one I hadn't bought, but I did have the paper for it, which the paper's coming back in the mini catalog, the yes. holiday mini, which yeah. is exciting. Um, Cause I love that paper. Um, yeah. So another, animals are really, really big right now. I don't know what it is. There's so many animals. Like we've got new animal punches. Now there's this new Happy Forest Friends uh, suite, which I think is super cute. I'm not sure I would ever have a use for them, but who knows? It's super cute. I may have to get it. <laughs> I do love this ribbon, however. It's got this really mm. cool Sahara sand and Olala ribbon. So um, The paper might be fun too. Yeah, the paper, the paper looks, looks like fun. it could be fun. Yeah. So, and if you have anybody, know anybody with uh, young ones, it would be a cute one as well. And then I absolutely, absolutely love the elephants. Um, yeah, they just so stinking cute. And what I am I going to do with them? But I'm going to buy them. I don't know when I'm going to use them, but I too am going to buy them. <laughs> I have to because they're so cute. They're super cute. I know a few people that have a thing for elephants. So, might make a birthday card or two. <laughs> well, you know, they're, they're very cute. There's dyes to go with quite a few of them too. There is lots Actually, of dyes. All of them. Yeah. And so the um <laughs> like the little grass too, and there's the little bows. Like it's just super cute. I don't know. But just look, really at those look at those eyes. Look at those eyes. How oh, cute. They're so that. sweet. That's that's oh. definitely eyes, Karen. Yeah, I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> For sure. And then for those that love fantasy, um, there's uh, this pure magic set, which I just love this dragon and the mermaid. I think they're really super cute. I don't know, drawn to it. <laughs> I knew you'd have, like that one. Yeah. <laughs> um, so flipping a few pages, we've got quite a few returning sets, which are great, but this I think is my absolute favorite suite, which I haven't and ordered yet actually. Right Oh, I'm so jealous. I haven't ordered it yet. It'll be on my next order for sure though. But I just love it. I mean, it's it's beautiful. It's got such a vintage feel to it that it's totally yeah. right yeah. up my alley. I got mine today. So, so I the, ribbon, the ribbon and the paper. I didn't order the the, the whole thing, but. Well, okay. Yep. I mean, and mine, mine came excited. today too, Linda. Yeah. <laughs> Did you all order like, on the day the catalog went live? No, mine was uh, <clears throat> day after, a couple days after. Okay. Yeah, I think mine was a couple that. of days after too. See, and I was going to order remember. the first day and then I thought, no, it'll never make it on time. So, oh well, it's all good. Yeah. <laughs> Next order. <laughs> oh yeah, for sure. And so moving on again, see like we've got the hedgehogs that are returning. We've got the count on me. So many animals. Lots and lots yeah, of yeah, 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 super fun. Um, then there's the these really awesome, um, kind of oh. stamp sets. Um, the stronger together is just amazing, and it lends itself really well to the uh, natural tone, um, blends. Markers, yeah. blends that came out um, recently. These were a pre buy from the annual catalog, um, so they're great for so many different things skin tones wood tones all sorts of things in your coloring they're really great 
I just think that stamp set is so powerful. It is, yeah. yeah, yeah, for sure. Really nice. Yeah, it's very nice. Um, so this is the Awash and Beauty suite, and this <coughs> is the card that I cased when I made that um, oh. teacup card. Oh. So it's got oh. some printed vellum on it with the circle oh. and the die cut. Oh, one. pretty. So that was the card that I cased. Oh, cool. <laughs> um, I really, really like in this die set, this diamond shaped background. Yes. I think that's super fun. I may have to get it just for that. <laughs> oh, oh my well, goodness. A, I oh, love it. That's what I was thinking. I wish they would just sell that lattice die by the <laughs> Yes. I oh, have enough flowers. So I think they do. Really do, don't they? Isn't it? No, not that no? I saw. Well, maybe no, I think maybe it's I part of the I think it's it's part of that oh part of the screen. <laughs> yeah, it's part yeah. of the screen. Yeah. It's part of the bundle. Yeah. Well, and, and the and set the of paper as well. Yes, that nice. paper. Yeah. And then we've got some really nice um, sort of more um, spiritual sets here um, yeah. that are beautiful. And one thing I wanted to point out on this page is the artistic mixed decorative masks. So we've got a new set of masks that have come into this catalog and they look like they're gonna be really fun to play with. There's a they few do. samples here that use them up here. It's hard to see on the camera, but down here. So I wanted to point that one out because you missed that because that's an easy thing to miss. I really don't use the masks enough. I know I need to start using mine more <laughs> for sure. So we've got more returning stuff and my catalog, I don't know about you guys, but my catalog pages stuck together. Well, I've got some that look like they've been in the water. Yeah, yeah. me too, Marilyn. They're just, yeah, they're all, rough. you know how when a page gets wet and then it dries, it's all rough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah mine were like stuck together. It's like they hadn't been cut <coughs> properly, so I had to like tear them apart. Yeah, page, 30, page 38, right, Marilyn? Yeah, back there somewhere. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Well, let me see. <laughs> page 38. Oh, yeah, mine kind of looks a little bit. Yeah, like, you're right. That's textured. <laughs> yep. Yeah. <laughs> they probably came out of the same box, Linda. Yeah. <laughs> so again, no, you know what mine is too. Yeah, Isn't that that's weird. weird. I don't know. Huh. Yeah, um, mine's the same. It looks like it went through the water. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. weird. Yeah. Um, so like I said, the envelopes with the flowers spilling out, that seems to be a theme. So this kind of goes with the, the teacup paper that had that mm -hmm. theme on them, which is really yeah, nice. Um, so this was the very first thing that I had to get off the pre-order because yeah. masculine is hard, yeah. uh, right? Masculine is hard. Yes. <laughs> and so this suite totally is perfect for masculine cards. And I loved it. And I didn't realize when I first got this, the specialty DSP paper. Mm -hmm. So the specialty DSP paper is spectacular. So it has you know, all these lovely masculine pages. So we've got um, this kind of hipster vibe. The, I love those glasses. Yeah, the glasses and the tie and the mustache. And then there's like some plaids. This has got a camping vibe. I, like I love the color. One. I mean, mm -hmm. it's really cool. Um, and then here we've got some Sahara sand with the cars on the back. And Cajun, the color combination is just really... Mm -hmm. It is yeah. very, very That's nice. Argyle. <laughs> and then some stripes, small strong stripes. And then here we've got like a barbecue thing going on. So there's those pages, which there's five designs. And then mine didn't stay together, they all fell apart. But they come with two pages of these die cut pieces. Oh, nice. So they're already pre cut little dies. So got all sorts of different ones. I like that one. I love that. Yeah. I like that too. Like this little <laughs> corn edge. And there's like the little. That's cute. Uh, cute. Van. <laughs> Cheers to all your years. Looking sharp. And so there's a whole like package of them. <laughs> yep. There's tools. There's all sorts of little um, bird ones. There's little. And some, some of them are the same as what the stamps are, right, Carmen? Yeah, they are. So they're, well, similar anyway. Um, let's see if I can find one here. So um, let's see. So 
Let me see every cloud. We've got best dad award going with the happy oh, fathers. Yeah. <laughs> so not not hundred percent the same, but they coordinate for sure. Okay. We've got the car, which here's a car. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the barbecue. That's a neat, neat idea to have those pieces like that. I yeah, yeah. there's like the little barbecue and then there's the holy smokes, you're amazing. <laughs> yeah, cute. <laughs> Which is really cute. And then there's um, you're a classic along with the happy birthday. So yeah, <laughs> lots of coordination, super fun. I wouldn't doubt if they didn't do this um, a little bit more in the future. Maybe, yeah. It because you know how they, they've started to do the um, the die cuts that match, um, cut out some of the DSP. Mm -hmm. And it's getting more and more and more, which is yeah. awesome. <clears throat> so I wouldn't doubt if they didn't do this a little bit more too. Yeah. So then we've got the rustic metallic adhesive back dots, which I love. They're love like those. Those are nice. Finish. And then... The stamp set, of course, um, which coordinates. There is some pieces like this, for example. There's die cuts of this little piece. And Neat. same with these. There's some little die cuts of that. And then we've got the die set, which has all these little labels that match here. So they coordinate with these. And of course, you can use them with various other sets as well. Um, or you can use it with eight. anything. You can use like, it's that. so versatile. Like that's. And this is my favorite die. That's cool. <laughs> it's just that's a little cute. argyle. <laughs> it's super cute. And there's two of them. <laughs> so you can cut out multiples. So I've made a few uh, cards with this one. So this one I did during mystery stamping. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah. Oh, nice. Beautiful. Beautiful. And then there's this one. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice. Which oh, that really is so great. simple, right? Like I just used the <clears throat> brick and mortar. Yeah. With oh, it's DSP great with that brick and mortar. Yeah. That's yeah. cool. And then so this one, it actually says happy birthday to a classic. So I just masked off the happy birthday and then stamped the, uh, mm. the happy Father's Day from another stamp set and put it across the top. That awesome. That one. And then this one again, just using a different embossing mm -hmm. holder. Oh, I like the wood grain. That's nice. Yeah, that That's looks nice. nice. Yeah, so it's just the timber 3D embossing holder. Yeah. Nice. So, super fun and really easy to make masculine cards with. Like, super easy. Yeah. <laughs> so that was a must have on my list. Um, so another masculine set is the vintage tools. I really like that one too. Yeah, I do too. I don't know how much I would use it, but I just think it's so cool. <laughs> yeah. Me either. Um, and then again, more animals. And Karen made this lovely card, which I think is adorable. That's beautiful. Nice. Uses that is adorable. Set with it. <coughs> so, yeah, super cute. Wow. So <laughs> Thank you. Nice. I don't have that stamp set yet, but it's on my list. <laughs> Wait, right up, because there's more coming. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. And then we've got the Sun Prince and everybody seems to love this one. It's not really high on my pro date. I think it's the blue. I'm not really drawn to the blue, but I did have to have the fern embossing folder, mm -hmm. which really nice. lends itself well to various things in the catalog, including Debbie's, one of Debbie's stamp set and bundles that she has, the foliage <laughs> ones. I think this- Oh yeah. Really, really oh, well for sure. That. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. It's really nice. That out. Beautiful. <laughs> Um, for an embossing holder. You're not drawn to blue? That just not like really. is totally not me. Yeah, it's, it, it's really bright. It's very bright. Yeah. But right. once oh, you maybe. get it, yeah. you look I'm at sure it. I'm sure it'll end up in my stash. But. <laughs> and the, like the, the back side is, is um, much more subtle. Yeah. Oh, for sure. Um, and then this one, so this is something else that's new. There's a vellum bundle. So it's a stamp set that coordinates with this specialty vellum, which I thought was really neat. So mm -hmm. I don't know. We'll have to see what the vellum looks like, but I just thought it was kind of cool. It's something different. It's very different, yeah. Vellum mm -hmm. is fun to play with, so. Yeah. 
we'll see what that one's like. And then uh, the mountain air is returning, but there's this new waterfall canyon. So if you like the how to build things together and create scenes, this one's a really cool one. And then my second favorite <laughs> is the texture sheet. Um, it's mm -hmm. a gorgeous DSP. I absolutely love the colors in it. And it, there's this specialty um, distressed gold 12 by 12 specialty paper. So I'm very interested to see what that looks like. Oh, I was going to ask box too. If you had it, <laughs> if it if it looks like the gold leafing, only it's in a sheet, maybe. Oh, maybe Karen, go open your box. Let's yeah, Karen, it. show us. <laughs> <laughs> called distressed. So, uh, yeah. I don't know. I'm very intrigued by it, but in a specialty <laughs> designer series paper too. So it's got the gold running through it, which is just so stunning when you see it. Do you like the stamp so. set, Carmen? I, I'm the stamp set. I'm not hundred percent sold on quite yet. Yeah. But I, I love the paper. The paper yeah. is really what papers really my attention. Yeah. yeah. And I do Me like too. the, um, in the dyes, it's got that background piece that you see up here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. on this card yes. which I think is really fun just to add some texture yeah so fun I wasn't yeah. sold on the on the stamp set at first <laughs> but it kind of like gives you so many different seasons right it, it does, does yeah mm -hmm. yeah because it's so like, I, I think it for, might be quite versatile yeah certainly it's got like the leaves that you could use for the fall yeah, the snowflakes and, and the snowflakes yeah. for the winter and then like the shells for the summer blossoms yeah and, yeah for the summer so yeah it kind of hits it's all the seasons for sure so another fun one and then um they retired my sailing home which i'm very sad about <laughs> however there is this new lighthouse set <laughs> which i think makes really cute lighthouses like that's adorable <laughs> <laughs> um and then of course we had the um, pre-order for the waves of inspiration uh, so this was a card i made recently with the waves that's beautiful. Right. Die cuts yeah. for the clouds and stuff. So. I love those clouds. I do too. I think the clouds are my favorite part. And I love the labels again. Labels are so fun. Awesome. And then these birds, I think I really, really like these birds, but I'm not sure. I don't know. I do like the bird cage. <laughs> so I, I know it's got, yeah. Again, it's the vintage thing, right? The bird mm -hmm. cage is vintage. I don't know. Catch I'm looking at that right now thinking, okay, on our um, community Facebook page, there's been, um, there's two budgies and a parrot that have been spotted in our neighborhood. And the owners finally came out and said, yeah, that's ours. They're ours. But now they can't catch them. Oh, no. So, I know. Poor little things. Oh, and no. why are they outside? I have no idea. Oh, but it's no. not warm enough for budgies in a pair. No. no. Mm -hmm. yeah. So, Carmen, it's chilly outside right now. Carmen, yeah. those, those birds are like a two step thing so that you must they layer are. different colors, eh? Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they look really fun because you can certainly like two or three step. I think they're three step for some of them. Um, so you can layer different colors on top of each other. Yeah, and like that I bottom mean, one on the branch, the two yeah. pieces go over top. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I didn't notice that until. Yeah. Pointed yeah, so I think that one's yeah, gonna be fun to cool. play with. Yeah. And and they're not creepy looking birds either. Sometimes they're <laughs> staring at you. <laughs> they're not staring at you. I don't think. I, I don't. Know. <laughs> backstory: I have a thing about some of Stampin' Up's birds that have evil eyes and yeah. they don't so that's <laughs> exactly i don't know debbie i know you have a, a thing about birds too so <laughs> maybe not yeah. oh, i love birds. birds it's just that the stepping up ones have evil eyes they're just <laughs> scary yes uh okay so hues of happiness Amazing, amazing, amazing. Oh, so fantastic. Awesome. Yeah. Um, so this is what's on the catalog cover. Uh, it's a beautiful suite. And the paper is amazing. And so it's got the stamp set, which has all these different sentiments and uh, super easy to color with blends um, or with any uh, color <laughs> medium. And then it has these lovely dyes. And I just love these ones. 
you can create your little booklet edge sort of thing and oh that's what that is stuff. yeah it, oh. it creates a, a booklet edge like yeah so it's like <laughs> a um, binder binder edge. like a binder oh. edge like here it's like it's pulled oh. off of a notebook oh, let's see like a coil notebook and you pull the oh, page wow. out kind of thing and yeah. maybe to the front, the, to the front yeah. of the catalog. Front of the catalog, yeah. It shows yeah. There. yeah. Oh. Right there. <laughs> oh, and I was going to ask about where that was. I almost texted Marilyn today <laughs> and asked to ask her, where here. do I find that? And then yeah, um, right here. I watched Joanne and she was showing the that manly, that masculine yeah. one. And I oh, thought, okay that a piece of the ephemera that was in there was probably that. Mm -hmm. I was wrong. Okay. It's this one. <laughs> oh, yeah. look at the that. Other thing, the other thing, Carmen, I just watched a video where somebody was saying they always had trouble coloring. And with this particular set, all you have to do is look at the designer paper and then color accordingly. Absolutely. Oh. <laughs> and I thought, oh, oh. that's a good idea. <laughs> brilliant for it, right? So yeah. the suite includes uh, the bundle, of course, the stamp set and the dies. And then it also includes these glossy dots assortment, which are super cute. They're very pretty. Very fun very and pretty. vibrant. And then this paper. So the dies, there are six dies that coordinate with this paper. Yeah. And it actually comes in this one and this one so all the different colors oh nice you cut out all of these leaves all of these flowers they can all be cut out with the dyes so super fun and super mm -hmm. easy to use and then this is got, an awesome suite like yeah, absolutely awesome got all of these different beautiful flowers this page i just love mm -hmm. <laughs> love 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 it's my favorite and yeah this, I, the coordination that they've got going on lately has just been out of the oh, world. Right? It's been amazing. Yeah. It yeah. truly is. It truly like, oh, is. Oh, that's so this pretty. It's just beautiful. Wow. Like you just beautiful. frame it. You can just frame it. You could it. frame it for yeah. sure. And then yeah. the other side, like so fun for all sorts of different things. Like, what a beautiful scrapbook page this would make. Oh, that's oh. at the card on the front. That's for the. Yes. It yeah. Is. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. yeah. So we've got the purples and the blues, the yellows and the greens. And then the pinks and the yellows, and then this fun one as well. So, yeah, super super fun. Carmen, so, can you show us yeah. that large die that comes? This one. Um. Oh. Okay. Is that it? Like it looks like in the catalog, it just looks <laughs> like a a big square, but that must be it. Yeah. Yes, that's this it. is it. Oh, okay. So it yeah. cuts out. Um. It doesn't like cut this all out it basically cuts out something out of a piece so if you've got oh. um if you run here let me do it real quick I'll show oh you. okay Give me one sec. If, i'm gonna grab a scrap piece of paper the one the one sample does show it too on page 108 it does but it'll be easier to see it yes uh, yeah but it's covered up oh i see flowers. marilyn yes. like yeah. Uh, yeah behind the one that says sending many thanks for yes. all you do. oh yeah. i see yeah, yeah so it kind of makes it like filigree yeah, it's, it's a backgroundy, yeah. backgroundy yeah. kind of thing, but yeah. Oh, yeah. wow. Oh, geez. Now I'm going to have to get put this on my list, too. I'm surprised it's not <laughs> on your list yet. Like, awesome. well, I, I, I got the paper, but oh, wow. Oh. Isn't that neat? Oh, it doesn't cut them so. all up, or you just didn't punch them out? No, nope. I didn't punch them out, but it doesn't cut them all out. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. Yeah. Oh, so thanks for good. doing that, Carmen. That's beautiful. Oh, really? Very cool. It is very cool. So beautiful, <laughs> sweet. Love it. So I have made a few cards out of this one. And actually, this one Carolyn made. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. So That's pretty. beautiful. So pretty. Mm -hmm. that one. And then this one is one I made during uh, mystery stamping. So this is all cut out of the designer paper. So mm -hmm. gorgeous. Together. Mm -hmm. And I use some of the glossy dots on there. So yeah, super fun and vibrant. Oh, and usually I don't use bright colors quite like that. <laughs> like I never <laughs> use Melon Mambo, ever. <clears throat> but it's in this and I've used it. <laughs> <laughs> oh this my one goodness. I from Very somebody, <laughs> I, was, I saw this and I just thought, holy cow. Like what That's similar, like similar that to the one I did last week. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 
I was just going to say that. Uh, yeah. And then this one, I just had to highlight this with the blue oh, paper. Oh, yeah. Again, yeah. Beautiful. These are cut out of the um, dies on the paper. And then I just used the, um, uh, what is it called again? <laughs> Dialect <laughs> shapes. Dialect, yeah. Yeah. And then this is the inside. Dialect shapes. Oh, ever neat. Yeah. Oh, cool. Nice. Yeah. So I yeah. thought it was a really fun way to showcase the paper. Oh, that's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Very oh, pretty. This beautiful oh, card. Pop up. <laughs> Love it. Yeah. There is another one further on that I've got in the catalog that I'll show you because I wanted to point something out later on. But super fun. Love it. And then next page, another punch bundle. Alphabets. So Debbie, you're a scrapbooker. Yeah. <laughs> Alphabet. Like oh. So comes in okay. handy. <laughs> Absolutely. So Tina, you're starting to get into some scrapbooking. Yeah. This would be a good one for you too. So yeah, like it's got this little punch, and there's all these little shapes, so you can stamp kind of a background, and then stamp your letter on top of it. Come up with different titles and things like that. Super fun. So cute. It is cute. Yeah. yeah. That one is also on my list. <laughs> I have a very long list. There's a new angel stamp, angel policy stamp set. Um, it's called limited edition. And so it's got the little um, copyright stamping up that you need if you're ever gonna sell any of your creations. So you have to- That's the one sure that I got for um, on stage or yes. on tour. On tour, yeah. yeah. Super fun. And then again, another page showcasing all the color color variations that is so that's super fun that is so beautiful it's a like beautiful to show layout. all the colors yeah. and so many different elements and stuff it's great yeah and all the different accessories are highlighted in yeah. here too different dyes different <clears throat> tools <coughs> super fun so Thanks. color collections of course we have the new ink colors um so we've got sweet sorbet parakeet party deep ocean tide starry sky and orchid oasis so um, one of our Stampin' Sisters, Tracy, made this card. Um, nice. She uses all of those nice. colors. Super fun. And then I thought, I'm going to make a rainbow card. And use the rainbow dies mm. with the ink oh, colors. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, nice. Yes. So super wow, fun. So cool. I used the starry sky in the background and as the words. And then I used the other four from the rainbow. Oh, oh, beautiful. Now I've got a whole Love bunch it. of these cut out because this dial comes out <laughs> the four ones. So a whole bunch of these cards are going to get made soon. <laughs> <laughs> but they're really nice colors. They've really grown on me since I saw them. That the first the first time I saw them, I was kind of like, eh. but yeah, they've really yeah, grown me on too, me I too. Like I'm that. still not. I'm still iffy on a parakeet, but a mm, parakeet is very bright. Yeah, I, at very first, bright. I thought garden green or sorry, granny apple green was quite bright, but when you hold the two together. Like, honestly, seriously, let me just grab a piece of each because, yeah. like, Debbie, you're going to just, like, <laughs> be shocked. They're beautiful colors. They're just maybe that yeah. mine kind <laughs> yeah. of. Yeah. So here's Granny Apple Green. It's fairly bright. This is Parakeet Party. <laughs> yeah. Like, wow. it's, yeah. It's quite neon <laughs> compared. It, it doesn't quite show it as much. Uh, it's at not least as much on the camera. camera. It doesn't show as yeah. much, but. Yeah, it is there's, a, bit, there's a big difference. Hey? There's quite a difference. Yeah. 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 For sure. So, anyway. Uh, okay. So, moving on, uh, another one of these post reward um, items I wanted to point out. There's another set of paper, 12 by 12 designer series paper post reward um, that you can, if you have a qualifying order of over $200 and you can get post rewards with your order, then you can get this for free. Um, so it's 48 sheets for each of 12 double sided designs and uh, it looks really pretty. So I'm excited to get that one with my next order because it will be over $200. <laughs> yeah, I like the one that has the uh, bicycles on it. Yes, you can kind of see a little bicycle piece yeah. oh. the back there. Oh yeah. There's a bicycle back there. So I'm excited yeah. to see that page. <laughs> yeah. It looks like lots of fun patterns. So. And then of course the Paper assortments, the different colors are in here as well. There's new ones for this year. So we've got the six by six and then each of the color families too. Another fun thing, that's that. And then of course we've got um, some 
or cards and envelopes. There's new craft note cards and envelopes, and then the tea boutique cards and envelopes, and then the slimline envelopes have made it into this catalog as well. They're into the slimline cards. And then again, this is that vellum that I pointed out. That's part of that vellum bundle, which is really neat. So we'll see what it looks like and how it works, but it's fun. Uh, vellum is always fun to play with, I think. And then all of these specialty papers. So we've got um, the Distressed Gold. There's this new brush stroke one, which looks pretty neat. It looks kind of like a painted texture or like a plaster kind of texture, um, which is really neat. It's nice. I have it. It's quite, quite thin, actually. It's very yeah, thin. Yeah, it's very thin. Yeah. Very thin. Um, and then I'm very, very excited about the rose gold 12 by 12 specialty paper. Definitely it's pretty. That. It's very pretty. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then some new embellishments. Uh, we've got the these ones are the matte decorative dots for the ink colors. There's a, some sweet sorbet ones. They're kind of like an ombre finish to them. <laughs> so they fade sort of into various colors. So darkest on this end, going to lighter towards the top. So there are various shades of being colors, which is fun. I like those little flowers too. These ones here? That, oh, yeah. Fun flower resin shapes. Yeah, they're yeah. pretty cute. Definitely pretty cute. And then again, punches, punches, and more punches. Loving the punches. I'm so happy. Loving the punches, punches too. It's like, Punches kind of went out of favor for a while there, and it was dyes, dyes, and more dyes, and now punches are back in, and I yeah. just think it's, it's great because punches are so easy to use. Yes. Um, <laughs> and yeah, super versatile. They take up more space, but you know what? They They're do. so much more convenient. Convenient, yeah, for sure. The sailboat builder has made it into the annual catalog, which I'm very excited about because it's really fun. <laughs> and then, yeah, lots of um, returning ones and some <clears> new ones are super fun and I just love all these builders like the ladybug strange thing is the tulip builder stayed in but the steps did not <laughs> steps it didn't yeah so bizarre <laughs> but we still got the deer builder which is great <laughs> I don't know there's a few things that retired that we kind of went hmm? why <laughs> maybe yeah. maybe there'll be something in the um July to the, the next I mini know. that I, I don't know I don't know. It's weird. Weird. Yeah. And <laughs> so something new that they've done for this catalog is there's <laughs> bundles with the cut and emboss machines. So if you purchase a mini stamp and cut and emboss, you can get the stylish shapes collection with it, which is the dies. Um, or you can get the sending smiles, which comes with the sending smiles bundle. Or with the regular cut and emboss, you can get the sun prints suite with it. That's a um, cool idea. It's a good idea. Um, mm -hmm. Different. Yeah. So we'll see. <laughs> I didn't really notice it because I've got all of this stuff. So I <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> so eh, we'll see. And then again, all of these, uh, the bundles. The great thing I love about these bundle kind of index pages is they have a new, a different, completely different um, sample that goes with them. So some of these have, you know, like the designer series paper that go with them. Well, typically this sample that's back here in this index doesn't show that designer series paper. They use the bundle by itself. And so it really showcases what you can do outside of looking at just what's on those sweet pages, which is really fun. So this is the one I wanted to just point out here. Um, so the Hues of Happiness, this is a really fun little card that they made here. So I decided to recreate it. And it was super easy. Oh, to nice. Oh, wow. Yeah. And so easy to color, like so mm -hmm. easy. <laughs> and the fun thing about this, so <coughs> if, as a demonstrator, we can actually, uh, Stampin' Up! has available for us the card recipes. So we can go into the website and we can find what they use to make each of these samples. So I went into that card recipes and I found what they did here. And this is actually white cardstock. I don't know if you can see it, but it's white cardstock oh. stamped in memento and then colored with the blends. Oh, so it's wow. kind of ombre. And that's how they did this one. It's kind of ombre. Wow. I to see it. It's a little bit darker. So, you know, when you look at those card recipes, 
you may learn something. And that's how I learned that trick about embossing in white first. So if you're stamping a color yeah. on colored cardstock, if you stamp it in Whisper White craft ink first and then stamp the color over top of it once it's dried, it makes the ink pop more and so it stands out better mm. and I learned yeah. that trick through looking at those samples yeah mm. the only downside is they don't give you measurements there do they um I honestly don't remember I don't think so I don't, no, I don't think, think so either yeah. Yeah. yeah but so but well, you can yeah. figure them out. we're smart for the most part you can for the most part yeah out. this one you can't really see it very well on camera but it's stamped in Versamark on the background. Oh yeah. With the yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. You can see that there. So yeah. Pretty. Wow. Well, very pretty. easy to do. Very ones. pretty. Thank you. That so, is a fun uh, flower to color. I've been coloring is. those all day. Yeah, <laughs> it's a really fun flower for sure. So so yeah. So something to look at when you're looking through the catalog. This kind of gives you a different look at the bundles and takes you outside of what that suite might show. Yeah. Um, so just something mm -hmm. to keep in mind when you're flipping through the catalog. Um, let's see what else I got here. So <laughs> one thing I noticed, I don't know, I've never really noticed it before, but in this catalog specifically, there is a lot of dyes that don't go with anything else. Yes. So just dyes, <laughs> standalone dyes. So there's like these deckled rectangles, there's the designer tags. Um, we've got this enchanting details die set up here. There's these frames here. There's like so many of them. <laughs> yeah. There's a mini pocket envelope. Um, we've got the, this one is a returning one, but the picture of this. Um, oh, but there's a lot too that, that are just basically shapes that Mm -hmm. Even if they do go with the bundle or, or a they could be used on their set, own. They could be used on their own. Absolutely. absolutely. Yeah. yeah. The pretty pop-ups are back here. Um, we've got this rugged icons one, which is kind of cool. Mm -hmm. And then there's this split card textures one, which is I'm interested intriguing. in that one. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank yeah. you. The sequins, uh, I, I don't really understand the sequins, but I no, don't know. I don't. <laughs> but it's, it's maybe when you see moment. something you will carmen maybe. carmen I, i've got to run because i've got a team meeting at eight o'clock so okay <laughs> thank you so much bye, bye, bye. 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 bye we're almost done here <laughs> i'll catch then, up on the on the replay sounds good and then the stylish shapes so these stylish shapes guys are really really versatile they replace the ones that retired a couple of years ago um so they're just circles and squares to, with uh, some banners and they're stitched um, they're so awesome. various layering sizes that you can use together. So um, super versatile, super like must have, I think, yeah. um, with a die cutting machine because they're, they can be used for so many things. Um, and then two more things. One, so many embossing folders, super fun. Uh, here's that quatrefoil tile that is in that uh, linen suite. That That's going to be gorgeous. It is. I think so too. And then there's this new um, embossing folder and die twigs and sprigs. So it has the embossing folder that does that, but then you can cut them out once you've embossed them. So interested to see what that one's going to look like. Yeah, I'm going to wait for somebody else to do that first <laughs> and then I'll see. Yeah, for sure. And then of course, we've got all of the post items that are kind of sprinkled throughout the catalog. You can see the designer series paper up here at the top and then the different stamp sets back here and then it explains what your stamp room awards are at the back of the catalog, of course. Um, and that is it. That's the catalog. Awesome. I mean, it's super beautiful. There's so many great things. It is. All my yeah. flags. <laughs> 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 so many lovely things in this catalog for sure. So. Very you guys exciting. want to take a look at the foil paper? Yes, yeah. we do. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if you, how well you can here. see it, but. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, it's oh wow. It is that's really gorgeous. pretty. Yeah. Is it thicker? Um, It's, yeah. no, I would say it's about the same, um, the same as regular DSP. Okay. But it is only like one side of it. Yeah. But it is, um, it is very pretty. It is oh, very pretty. Oh yeah. 
Yeah. It was very pretty. Mm -hmm. Definitely going to have to get that. <laughs> Beautiful. Very well, thank you for digging into that box and showing us. <laughs> Are you kidding? I want to rip that box open. I know you do. You're itching <laughs> to do it. I know. <laughs> anyway. Well, well thank you. That was awesome. And good, everybody dude. that joined me tonight, I'm going to put your name in for a draw. And, note, and I will reach out to you and let the winner know. So I'm writing everybody down right now. We've got mm -hmm. yeah, Ready? And, uh, <laughs> and there it is. Awesome. Let's go and see what else I ordered. I can't remember. <laughs> oh, fun, best, Karen. Isn't it? <laughs> yes. Yeah. I got Abigail Rose. Oh, oh, oh. I can't wait to get that one top of my list for sure. <laughs> awesome. Well, thank you everybody for joining me. Thank you, Carmen. Oh, thank, thank you, you Carmen. Carmen. Yeah, yeah. Now you can awesome. go watch your hockey game. Yes, yes. just in time. Yes. Hockey starts <laughs> in a couple time, Carmen. <laughs> it was good to see everybody. You yeah. too, everybody. Yeah. Yeah. Bye, Bye everyone. Thanks, Have a good Carmen. week, everybody. You're welcome. <laughs> Talk to you soon. Bye.